Hello, I'm Blaze. This is an end term, namely botany quiz, part 3. In this video, I'll ask you some questions, and you have to answer the following option correctly. First question, how many possible number of cotyledons are there? Is it, 1, 2, or 3? The answer is 2. In flowering plants, namely angiosperms, there are typically two types of cotyledons, monocot and dicot seeds. Second question, to fill in the blanks. Blank, a part of a flower found in the center to collect pollen. Is it anther, ovary, or stigma? The answer is stigma. The stigma is part of the female reproductive system of a flower. The stigma is on top of the style and is the apex of the reproductive system. It is waxy or sticky to collect the dry pollen, which is blown by the wind or transferred by insects. Third question, stamen is the male productive part of a flower. True or false? The statement is true. The stamen is the pollen producing reproductive organ of a flower. It typically consists of a stalk called the filament and an anther, which contains microsporangia. Depending on the species of plant, some or all of the stamens in a flower may be attached to the petals or to the floral axis. Fourth question, which type of food is made from stems? Is it broccoli, cucumber, or lemon? The answer is broccoli. Broccoli is an edible green plant vegetable in the cabbage family made from stems. The vegetable is rich in vitamin C and K, dietary fiber, and various nutrients, making it a popular choice for a healthy diet. You can find other foods like asparagus, celery, potatoes, etc. And fifth question, to pick one wrong option. Which part of a plant does not have roots, leaves, and stems? Is it bryophytes, gymosperms, or pteridophytes? The answer is bryophytes. Bryophytes are non-vascular plants that do not have true roots, stems, or leaves. They rely on simple structures for water and nutrient absorption and distribution because they lack the vascular tissues found in higher plants. So, this video is about Botany Quiz, Part 3. Like, comment, and subscribe now.